Address to Ahegus. Bear for your honest sonsy face, great chieftain of the button race. I bend the more you tack your place, paint tripe or therm. Wheel of your worthy of grace as long as my arm. The groaning trencher there ye fill, your heart is like a distant hill. Your pen would help to mend a mill in time of need. All through your pores the dews distill like amber bead. His knife, see your rustic labour dight, and cut ye up with ready slight, and trenching your gushing entrails bright like only ditch, and then, oh, what a glorious sight, warm, reeking wretch. Then horn for horn they stretch and strive, deal tack the hen must on they drive, till all their wheel swelled kites be live, are bent like drums, then old good man may like to arrive. <laughs> we thank it, um, is there that o'er his French ragu, or oleo would stour sue, or fricassee would macker spew with perfect scunner, looks down with sneer and scorn for view and secadena? Poor devil, see him out his trash, as feckless as a withered rash, his spindle shank and get whiplash, his neve a net through bloody flood or field to dash. Oh, how unfit! But mark the rustic, haggis fed. The trembling earth resounds his tread, clapping his whaley neva blade. He'll mack a whistle, and legs and arms and heeds will sned like taps a thrissle. Ye powers, why make mankind your care, and dish them out their bill of fare? Old Scotland wants no skinkin' wear the jobs and luggies, but if ye wish her great for prayer, Gear a haggis. 